crazy to think that nine years ago, almost to the day, is when I met you. How well we've come to know each other and how much I love you feels like I've known you my whole life. I fell in love with your sense of humor, but it's the way you actively listen and encourage the person you're talking to that showed me you're my person. I fell in love with your intellect, but it's your curiosity to learn new things and humbleness. I fell in love with your kindness, but it's the way you show up for and come to the aid of your family, friends, and even strangers. I fell in love with your sense of spontaneity, but it's your ability to slow down and embrace the moments together. I promise to be honest with you in all things, even when the truth may be uncomfortable, because our relationship is built on trust and honesty. I promise to support your dreams and passions because seeing you fulfilled fulfills us both. I promise to always find lightness and humor with you, even in those inevitable low points in life. I promise to choose the big adventures with you and to do the mundane tasks of everyday life with you because eating frozen pizzas on the couch is just as fun as being A's and nice. And lastly, and probably most importantly, I promise to always believe that this will be the season when the Buffalo Bills start their streak of Super Bowl wins. <laughs> so thank you for choosing me and our relationship every day, and I promise to choose us. I love you, and the only way I can, the only way I can end my vows to you, go Bills. Betsy, you are my favorite person I've ever met. You're beautiful, which is obvious, but there are so many different reasons why I love you. I love how you care so fiercely for your family and everyone in your support system. Your love for the humans around you is a deep source of hope for me. You make friendship a fine art. You're a great listener. You make anyone talking to you feel not only heard, but as if whatever they're saying is the most interesting thing in the world. Even if it's just me breaking down Bill's data, uh, latest defensive scheme. But you are clearly a very patient person, and I love seeing how good you are as a dog mom to uh, raising our daughter, Puna, together. When the people around you are feeling something, you feel it too. I see this manifest in the drive you have to help people. You are my superhero working nights as a respiratory therapist during the pandemic, and you still are today. Anyone that really knows you knows that you're the prime example of the phrase, don't mistake kindness for weakness. BT is your life partner. I vow to work through problems with you and communicate. Always be there for you through the good and the bad times. I verbally express my emotions to you. I know that words of affirmation is your love language. To maintain respect for each other, to make you laugh, to never go to bed angry. I want to vow that I won't destroy another ligament in my knee playing beer league football, forcing you to take care of me for months after that, but there are limits to what I can commit to. Uh, in all seriousness, the world doesn't realize how lucky it is to have you in it, Beatty. You're the most beautiful person I know inside and out, and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. <laughs>